I just don't understand how employers in the hospitality sector, in the events sector, in the beauty sector, those businesses that have been dis effectively described by the Chancellor as unviable, but are only unviable because they're not legally allowed to operate um, effectively and fully at the moment, can be expected to pick up the tab from the state. No one is arguing that furlough or any other scheme should continue indefinitely or the state should, should take the place of the private sector. But at the moment, the government is restricting them legally and not allowing them to operate at full capacity so it is right that we step in to support them there is a cost to not doing this a cost to individuals as they lose their jobs a cost to the communities as unemployment ripples through them and mass unemployment doesn't just affect those individuals and in the economy now it echoes down the generations i know that having grown up in south yorkshire from the last time we had mass unemployment in the 1980s so for liz trust to sit there and say the private sector needs to in the middle of a global pandemic is nothing short of reckless and complacent.